Hey, what's going on? Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Travis Patel. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick case study on some advertising I've been doing over the past 24 hours in the internet marketing niche. Now, recently, if you've been following me, if you uh, are on my list or anything like that, you know I've been doing a lot of Facebook advertising selling t-shirts through the popular platform Teespring. Now, the whole plan when I started this about 60 days ago was to find a system that works, make it work for myself, find all the tips and tricks and all the tweaks to make this really run for someone else, turn it into a digital product, and, and help that grow, use that to help grow my business consulting and internet marketing business. So, my first product coming out is on March 4th that's going to be covering my Teespring method. So right now, we're really focusing on building that prospect list, and that's exactly what this advertising that I started yesterday is to do, to find those potential buyers who want to learn about Facebook advertising, social media, Teespring, all that area. So as you can see right here in front of you is my squeeze page, one of the variations of my squeeze page for this system. Now, I start, I'm start. i starting out my advertising on the Warrior Forum. It's a very popular uh, forum for internet marketing and business and online marketing and all that good stuff. Uh, so there's a lot of prospective buyers who would like this type of information. So there's two spots on the Warrior Forum that I really wanted to test that I put into action. And first off, we have the top banner ad. This is $100 per day. As you can see, this is mine right here, free Teespring case study. When they click this, they're sent to this page. And I was testing this out. We got another probably four or five hours left on this that's running. But I wanted to test this against and also have more traffic coming in from a WSO post. Now, we're not doing a paid WSO. We're doing a free WSO where it costs $40 for me to post a WSO. But that traffic comes in and they see this. This is just like a mini, very mini sales page. Discover how a Teespring new car breaks over blah, blah, blah in first week. It's got my stats. Click here to watch this case study, my information, and that is it. This is just one image that I made, and they can click anywhere, and it's going to be, it's going to send them to the squeeze page. So I really want to test those two out. I'll show you those numbers here shortly. But uh, what we have, we got about. Let me see the numbers for those two combined. We got 98 uh, prospects yesterday, 37 today. So that is, you know, 100 and. 35 so 135 leads from $140 spent so far which is not too bad uh, considering what I'm going to the system we have in place it's a long-term list you know adding another thousand people to your list is always going to add money to your income every month or add income to your month so these leads are very powerful when you have that system set in place. Now the first thing I want to do with this this system is we definitely want to make sure we're testing out our landing page. When we're paying for traffic we want to make sure that it's actually going to convert and that it's actually going to become a lead and a buyer. So I was using Visual Website Optimizer set up two variations. This is actually variation one and there's the control which I will show you now with Visual Website Optimizer, you saw those numbers. They don't track everyone. Here's the second version of my landing page. So that's what's being tested, the other one. But like I was saying, Visual Website Optimizer, you know, they say we only got 55 conversions and then we have actually 135. This only counts people that don't have cookies turned off, don't have JavaScript turned off, all these different settings. So it's going to kind of give you the raw numbers, but I like to use this to see which one is converting better. And right now we have variation two, or vari the variation is converting a little bit better, but it's kind of been going up and down the whole time. As you can see, it's only a few off, and as you go more, it kind of It'll, it'll fluctuate. So I like to spend, you know, 500 viewers. I'm going to let go through this before I actually pick a winner and move on to the second case study or the second uh, split testing. Where when we find that winner, I'll start testing the color of the headline. I'll start testing, you know, the bullet points, call to action, all that type of stuff. So that's a very important part of the the system here. Now. What's very uh, even better about this is that I set it up to where you know where the plan is to make money back from these leads. You know, you're getting these leads to 
sell things later on. Like I said, I have a product coming March 4th, but that's not the only spot we want to make some money. So right when they sign up, they click get, get instant asset access, they're put on my list, but they're sent to a thank you page like I like to do often. And this is just like a thank you for joining me. This is what you can expect. Here how you can contact me. But right below this, we put here are my other products. And I just put some very simple layout to the other digital products I have that are in this market. Uh, you know, niche marketing, this is very popular for this type of crowd. And then Facebook advertising. These three products are focused on Facebook advertising. Now, from this page alone, with nothing, no promotions in my email yet, um, I've been able to do a good, we've done almost, uh, what's that, 105 bucks or something there. So, we've only really lost, we're in the red, $35 here. Um, and we have leads that are going to make us money in, in the in the long run. So, so overall, advertising in both these spots definitely have paid off. It's going we're going to continue to advertise in the top banner here. Um, I guess let's take a look at the numbers as well. Here's the two we've got going. This is the top banner. It's got 219 unique votes. The WSO post has got 167 unique posts. So out of our subscribers there, we're converting at like 35% of our traffic. So 167 times 35. We're looking at, we got about 58 subscribers from our WSO post. And 76 subscribers from our Warrior Forum banner post. So it's just kind of a, a quick look at advertising on the Warrior Forum, seeing what you're going to get, um, how you can get your money back. I mean, you could do this much better where you actually have a one-time offer after they sign up instead of just a thank you page with something like this. That will get a lot more conversions. Plus, the email system you have set up right now, my email autoresponder, is just content because I'm getting them prepped and warmed up for March 4th when I launch my product so I'm not going to be promoting any products to them for the next two weeks it's all going to be straight content and telling them get ready for the product get ready for the product get ready for the product that's the whole point of this pre-launch system but if I was doing this for any other list building system I had out there that I didn't have a product coming in the future then I would have an autoresponder series set up that promotes a product every two or three days plus a one-time offer system there right after they subscribe so that we can make our money back ASAP where I know that those 100, 150 people we just got subscribed we're gonna get a good probably five to ten of those are going to buy that Teespring product that I launched on March 4th and then the one-time offer there in that system so it's just you know always list building is king because of that that reason right there you're gonna be able to continue to promote to them continue to make money off them and and continue to help them so i hope you got a lot from this i know i was kind of jumping around blabbering a little bit there but uh this is just what i've done the past 24 hours uh to kind of get my my list started in this this pre-launch buzz today we're starting some facebook ads and stuff like that to add to the mix so thanks guys travis patel here have a good one